Good morning. I bid to the members of the floor. I am Madam Evelyn Laho. Would like to present my thesis research entitled to enable 15 year for Chakal peoples in SK Kuala Baramdua to read with correct pronunciation and stress by using the individualized reading card method. From our observation as teachers in our school, we find that pupils who are below average do not have the ability to read English words with correct pronunciation and stress. The pupils are from different background <clears throat> and with the effect of language barrier. Hence, pupils are not able to read a simple English words. Teachers too undergo a lot of frustration when teaching the, the pupils to read English words with correct pronunciation, although they have undergone streaming class. These are my target group, my year four Chakaos. Our research focus on 15 year four Chakal peoples who are unable to read basic English words such as cat, fish, milk, food with the correct pronunciation and understanding. I divided the peoples into two groups. The first group, average with only five peoples and the other group below average with 10 peoples. Our general objective for our research. This research aims to boost the reading skill of 15 year four pupils who are unable to read basic English words with the correct pronunciation and stress. Our specific objective for our research, at the end of this research, the pupils will be able to read and understand the vocabulary words as in the text given. To identify at least four action words in the text given. To construct three simple sentences. This action research was conducted from 6 July until 6 October 2020. After guidance was done by teacher with all the 15 pupils, group one students who were able to read will be given worksheet for exercise while group two student who were unable to read will be guided personally by the teacher. I have designed a method called individualized reading card to enhance people in their reading skills. The reading card will be signed by pupil's parent after successful guidance. Home-based learning that involving parents' guidance in reading. The card will then be signed by the teacher after completing a reading session in the class. People's that completed their reading card 
will be rewarded. These are the flow of the research. <clears throat> Firstly, people were taught how to pronounce basic English words. People were required to read the accent vocabularies repetitively. That is read, daily reading session with their family members. Then, Parents will sign the reading card. People read the action words with the correct pronunciation with the teacher in the school. Teacher then sign their individualized reading card as approval. People perform post tests. Here, we can see one of the people's parents was teaching their, was teaching the pupils to read. Now we can see the video. Next one, <clears throat> Muhammad Ara's mother was teaching him to read. I designated individualized reading card to be signed by their parents and by the teacher. For this research, I applying 3B strategy that are bacha, reading, bimbing, guiding, and then Boleh baca, and then they can read. Pupils will be able to read with correct pronunciation. To boost the pupils' confidence as they're able to read basic English words, yet 
show improvement in the English language test. After the pupils able to, to pronounce the action correctly, I will instruct them to construct a simple sentence by using the given action words. This is to stimulate a positive learning atmosphere. For further research, in future, we plan to expose the peoples to different sentence pattern with various difficulty level and writing assessment. This is to boost their English vocabulary usage and by writing different varieties of sentences in their answers, the peoples will score better marks. Besides, we also plan to teach the peoples to combine two simple sentences to form compound sentences. For instance, two simple sentences such as the cat can jump high, the, the cat hides well, can be joined using the conjunction N to form the cat can jump high and hides well. This sentence structure will also enable people to score more marks in English language test. This is the reading card that I gave to the pupils. And then this is the vocabulary cards written at the back of the card. And then the, the another card, the individualized reading card. On the cards, people's name, and then the details, the task, task one, task two, two, task six, six tasks for three months. The death and the parent signature, and then also teacher's signature. These are the 15 peoples of year for Chakal. They are doing their reading in the class. Table one is comparison of the number of people score for pre and post tests. Example, for zero to two marks, for pre test only eight peoples. And then for post, uh, post test, none. The next table, Table two, marks achieved by the peoples for the pre and post test. Example, for Aaron, two marks for pre-test, and then for the post test, he get four marks. As for the pre-test level, most people perform below average, scoring only zero to two marks out of 10, whereas none of the people score more than six marks. However, in the post-test, most people were able to score better, scoring three to six marks out of 10, while some people were able to score above six marks. Strategy using individualized reading card method. From the research, we can see a marked 
improvement in the people's test score within a duration of three months so that the objective of the research has been achieved. That's all from our research. Thank you very much.